my name is Josiah. I'm here to tell you how to do binary code. So it's both that this weird looking country thingy, there's starting to become chaos in it. So instead of breaking out into war and battle and all that kind of stuff, they decide to split it. You know, just like West and East Germany. So, now that they split it, there's going to be so much chaos anymore. That's, that's good. So we'll mainly be talking about this country. But, but whenever a country splits, it's going to affect their languages, their currencies, colonies, a bunch of other stuff. We'll mainly be talking about their currencies. So, their currencies are 1 cent, 2 cent, 4 cent, 8 cent, 16 cent, 32 cent, and 64 cent. Notice that you're just multiplying the next, the one behind by 2 to get the next one. So in this case, 32 times 2 is 64. And you can do that with the next one. 64 times 2 is 128, but we don't need to break that down. Okay, so suppose this man is going to the store, and it's 50 cents for a pound of apples, which he wants to buy. So he has one of each of these coins. His question is how much would he have to pay? Because he only has one of each of those coins. <coughs> so, so, here he made a chart to determine on how much he has to do. 64, 32, 16, etc. All that stuff up there. So, and here's how much he has. So, let's make the zeros be how much he, let's make the zeros the one that he keeps and the ones, the ones that he pays. So, we'll make the zeros in pink. I'll erase this after. I know this isn't right for 50 cents. We'll change it in there. And this color for the ones. So, if you pay zero, the store wouldn't the store wouldn't accept that apples. He would just, he would need either more or exactly on how much. So, he's going to have to start to add. 64 would be too high. He doesn't want to waste 14 cents on it. So, you have to do 32. The 32 would still be too low. So, he's going to do 32, all the ones behind 32. So this is over the right amount. So the store would be satisfied, of course, because they would be paying more than he needs to, but he would not. So he is going to keep some more for himself. He's going to have to do this quick before the store gives up and makes the next person come. So now he's going to try with the eight. So, you know, 16 will make 47, and the store would not be satisfied with that. So, he's going to take 63 from 8. Should we take away? This is more. 5, 5, 5. So, now he's at 55. So, he took the 8 there, away from there. And this thing is. We're going to call our chart, so I'll have to take away the 8 in our chart. So, now that he's done this, he is going to have to take the 4 away. He's 2 and 1 would still be to the... Okay, so... He could just give up on this and just say, okay, 51 is close enough. But this country 
is quite new, so it is not going to accept. So, so these colonies are quite new. I mean, this, these <sighs> currencies are not are not are new. So he's going to have to who to make it because he would rather keep one and do math than having to do the other one. Although he doesn't really have to do math because it's just 51 take away 1. Easy. 50. And he solved his problem once he's done, once he's done that. Because 51 take away 2 would be 4 and 9. The store wouldn't be satisfied. So, here's how much he would have to pay. So, he feels happy that he's done this with only one of those things. It's one of the challenges in their country that they made. So, I'm going to write this thing out without having to have this chart line around it. And I'm not going to do 64 because it's a zero. So, let me do this in and over here. So say that I think that you've all heard of binary code. You can program computers. So so say this is like in the 1900s, where binary code wasn't there. So he's going to use this binary. So he, this is the binary code of, of that. So. He doesn't know that it's called binary code, which symbol is bin. So he's going to go over to computer shop and see about binary, to see about this number. Because he thinks that it could be used for something. So he goes up and shows them that, and then they decide that, and then they decide to call it binary code used to come program computers. That is not really true, like he didn't come up and do that, but it's just in the story. Okay, hope you learned something about binary code. Oh, in my next video I will do more advanced ones that uses 6428, oh, maybe up to 256, and I'll see you there. Bye.